What's going on guys, my name is Jeffrey, welcome back to Progressions, and it's for the Zane Entertainer official video, so a lot of people have been asking for more Zane, so we're finally doing it, hopefully this doesn't get blocked, that's why it takes me forever to do like, music videos especially, is because I just don't want to like, I love doing it, just like, it's just a pain once it gets blocked, because it's just so, just mentally frustrating when it gets blocked, so I just try to like, I don't even like, want to do, cause just from that standpoint, but hopefully, this will be okay, so yeah, if you're new to your channel, you should definitely subscribe button, click the like button, let me know what you guys want to see next, in the comment section below. And uh, yeah, let's check this out. By the way, I might I might pause this a little bit just so it doesn't get blocked. You thought you had me dear to you when you lied to my face. I could see the truth every step of the way I knew. I fool me, boo. Guess you didn't know that you were my favorite entertainer. I watch you, I laugh, I Dude, fuck with you. Why is he like such a badass in all of his music videos? Like, he's literally a badass in every single one. Like, he literally is. Like, he has like this suit. He's still like just like mysterious like he's such like he's like this like mobster type of dude but in every music video i've seen so far dude he's such a badass every time like he's walking around with this suit and the camera angles are always super dope that's actually i love this Ooh. that's a fake tattoo right for sure right that's fake that's fake right i'm pretty sure that's fake Is this a song about uh, Gigi Hadid? Because like you're my favorite entertainer. Is because she's kind of like a model, so I, I consider her an entertainer, right? So this could this be just about Gigi? Like you're my favorite entertainer, right? Let me know in the comments. But I'm pretty sure, right? I think so. I'm gonna show you thing or two. Never seen you coming. Is that five a fake tattoo or is that a real one? Because that might be like a One Direction tattoo with like the five, right? Five members. So that might be a lot of, a lot of his uh, music videos I've noticed are like very like sexual, which isn't an issue. But I just that's the one thing I've noticed from like the other boys is that he's very like he's like making them a very mature music. I feel like yeah, I feel like Zane's like made the most mature music out of all of them. Kind of like you know, and the other ones kind of like they matured a lot, but like he like makes very mature music. I've noticed. <laughs> I love how he does that little entertainer right at the end. That's such, dude. I love this part of the song right here. This part is actually super good. Why is this? Why does that look like a 40 year old version of Ryan Seacrest but with a mustache, bro? Look at this dude. Does that not look like Ryan Seacrest but like 20 years older with a mustache? And like his. Bro, that kind of. His face looked kind of. That's why I thought it was Ryan Seacrest for a second. Low key. But I was like, I don't think he'd be in this. I love that beat. What is that? It does it sound like drums, like a really good beat, but it sounds like some sort of instrument that's like kind of like using the beat right here. Like listen to it, listen to it. 
What is that? I, I guess that's just a beat. I guess that's an electronic beat, but it kind of sounds like an actual like instrument or something else that's like not because it's not like an exact beat. It's like a kind of like a I don't know. I don't know what I call that. Oh, that was dope. Let's listen to that again. Let's listen to that again. Let's listen again because literally that's like a Zane specialty is to have a high note in the background. He did it with One Direction. He still does it now. Apparently, that's just like his. He just, you know, he just likes putting a high note at the end of the song. Apparently, you know, right in the background. He has the nicest cars in his music video too. I love the way he does his music videos too. It's like on like this weird, like it's kind of like 70s, 80s footage, like, you know, Miami kind of like, I really like the way he like shoots his music. Like he has a very like precise artistic mind. That's why I've noticed a lot about him. He has a very precise and artistic mind. And I can see that's why he like wanted to be solo so bad is because he very has a specific view of what he wants to do and he does it so well so it's like he really like you know he really just needed to be solo because he has like look at his music videos his songs they're very artistic like it's like a painter it's a very meticulous and how he plans out everything i can tell is very just precise to way the way he wants it you know and there's the briefcase like look at the satisfaction even thumbnail like it's very like it's very precise how he wants everything and i think that's like his that was like it was an issue with like the boy i am he ends up like not like like one direction it's just very he needs to like have control over it himself and like know what he like he wants needs to have control over it and that's like a lot of artists do they you know artists there's not five artists paying one thing it's one artist and that's what he really needed to do was to get you know to be able to just like express himself artistically with all of it so yeah it's gonna do i really enjoyed the song really enjoyed the music video really love the way they did that if you're new to your channel you should definitely subscribe button click the like button let me know what you guys want to see next in the comment section below and i'll see you on the next video